The city Vision Zero campaign was launched to lower the amount of people hurt or killed on the roads in America's finest city. But since it launched in 2015, more people are getting in violent accidents. Our Liberty Zabala joins us live in Ocean Beach at the site of a hit and run that sent two people to the hospital. Liberty. Good evening, Kathleen. It was just last Friday when a man and woman were struck here and the driver took off. Now, Crime Stoppers is offering an award to help find that suspect, but neighbors in this area say this happens all too often. On Green Street, just off Point Loma Boulevard in Ocean Beach, neighbors are uneasy after a driver plowed into a couple and sped off. It's scary because I love my neighborhood, but they're have been a lot of uh, aggressive cars. The San Diego Police Officers Association is raising the alarm over the rise in traffic deaths despite the city's Vision Zero initiative to bring traffic deaths down to zero by 2025. We're absolutely in the last two years trending in the wrong direction. In 2017, we had a, the mid 30s for fatal traffic collisions, which is still too many. A Vision Zero update found there were 67 deadly traffic collisions in 2021. That jumped to 69 deaths last year. Traffic collisions almost double, and then the same time frame, the traffic enforcement has been reduced in half. SDPOA's Jared Wilson says the lack of officers and cuts to SDPD's traffic enforcement worsens the problem. Traffic enforcement saves lives. The people who live in the neighborhoods want the traffic laws enforced. They want people be held accountable when they're speeding, be held accountable for running those red lights, running those stop signs. And we're just not able to really have those officers in the field and enforce those laws because they're chasing 911 calls, because we're 200 officers down. He advocates to restaff and reinvest in SDPD's traffic division. Specifically traffic division, I would agree with that. It's, I've lived other places and I probably, I rarely see anyone pulled over. Uh, if they stick strictly to traffic, I would agree with that. Now, those two victims are currently hospitalized at this moment, and we also reached out to the city's transportation department for comment, and we are waiting to hear back. For now, live here in Ocean Beach, Liberty Zabala, Fox 5 News.